Now, three Gaelic footballers and a rugby player will soon be thrust into the American football shop window. They'll join the best young hopefuls from U.S. college football in front of scouts from all 32 NFL teams. A week-long trial in distance and accuracy will determine who wins a potentially life-changing place in the NFL draft. It's a story that could change Irish sport forever. After working hard for months, four Irish athletes now have a chance to impress in the NFL Combine in Indianapolis next month. After making the league's international player pathway, Rory Began, Mark Jackson, Charlie Smith and Dara Leader are now looking for professional contracts. Monaghan's former all-star goalkeeper Began will forego his county's number one shirt for now, but says the prospect of making an NFL contract is a hugely exciting one. Something different to what I'm used to, but it's... Uh... It's a cool journey, like you know, from watching it on TV at the weekend, the playoffs and stuff. It's cool to be practicing it here and, and getting better and better as, as the weeks go on. So, look, Florida's only around the corner now, and that's when the real, real work goes in because you're there constantly working day on day. So, um, yeah, it's been a great journey so far, but hopefully it'll get better. Wicklow goalkeeper Mark Jackson could be the second Orchard County representative to play in the NFL alongside Daniel Whelan. If you look at the, you know, the, the talent in Ireland, it's, it's definitely there. You can see the Australians going over to NFL punting. Why can't our Irish people do that? Why can't Irish guys do that? 32 teams will send scouts and coaches to the upcoming combine and before that is a month-long kicking camp in Florida overseen by former Connacht rugby player Tig Leader who runs Leader Kicking. Leader initially set out to help Irish athletes get college scholarships, but now the big franchises are taking note. The combine's huge. They say every franchise, every scout, GM is going to be there. All US media descends on Indianapolis. So it's gas to think here we are in Sport Ireland just kind of knocking around, people wondering who are you lads, and we're going to be in front of the world in come March. If you look at the big picture, it can get overwhelming. So uh, thankfully the lads have proven performers in their own sport, so they should, they're taken through quite well. Opportunity knocks loudly for these Irish players who've worked so hard over the last six months to achieve their dreams. One final step remains, they'll go for it full throttle. Damien Lawler, RT News, Abbottstown.